Divisibility rule of six. A number is divisible by six if it is divisible by both two and three. Now let's go to the first example. In the number 23,562, it is an even number, therefore two goes into it. Now let's see if three goes into this number. Now remember, the rule of three is add up all the numbers, and if three goes into the sum, then three goes into the original number. Now three goes into 18, therefore three goes into 23,562. Now since both numbers go into this number, then that means six goes in, that means that six goes into 23,562. Now in the next example of 20, 236, it is even, that, then that means that two goes into 236. Now let's go to the next number of three. Let's add up all the numbers. Now three does not go into 11, so that means that three does not go into 236. Therefore, 236 is not divisible by six. In 501, it is an odd number, therefore two does not go into it. And since two work, then we don't need to go any farther because both numbers have to work. In the next example of 1002, it is even, so that means that 2 goes into it. Now let's add up all the numbers and see if 3 goes into this number. Three goes into three, so that means that three works. And since both two and three work in this number, then that means that 1002 is divisible by six. In the last example of 780, it is an even number, so that means that two is, well, two goes into 780. So let's see if three works. Three goes into the number 15, so that means that three works in this number. And since both two and three work, therefore, 780 is divisible by 6.